Okay, so Dan decided to do something a little different, and he decided to take his fat, his box in, how did I say it? He decided to take his box, instead of like opening a box of Battle for Zendikar, he decided to, for me to make him a box. And part of like making the box, I wanted to make sure there was enough value in just one card that could cover the box. That way it's not like, and I'll zoom in. This is a very, very good looking uh, Savannah. So it's got some whitening. I think it's probably, I mean, if you consider sign cards, always SP. Uh, it's unlimited, of course, so it's a little more valuable than its revised counterpart. It's got a little whitening on the top, a uh, little whitening here, but it's pretty, like, you can see that it's a very well taken care of card because it's mine. I pulled this one a long time ago, and I never traded away. Uh, typically, I don't trade away cards that I had get signed because if you're getting a card signed, you're, you, you are telling your you're pretty much destroying some of the value of it from buy listing at least, but it's a very unique card and obviously I would want it signed. If it was up to me, I would think getting a card signed would have more value than not, especially if it's signed by someone like Rob Alexander, who is obviously a very famous magic artist. So this one will be shipped to you, Dan, but as well as I'm gonna fill these boxes with just random old vintage cards and I just have a pile, like, so we'll see what you get. Prodigal Sorcerer, Psychon Venom, Wall of Swords, White Air Element, oh, Anime Artifact. So I know one of the animates is expensive. I don't know if it's Anime Artifact. Look at it, Enchant Non-Creature Artifact. That's pretty cool. Creature Bond, Feedback, Flight, Flight. Ooh, life tap. Oh, I used to play this all the time. You gain one life each time at any forest opponent becomes tapped. False orders. What is this one? Uh, this kind of looks... Fireball, of course. <laughs> and these are from... Un I'm pretty sure these are from Unlimited. Uh, Dragon Whelp. Phantasm. Ooh, Lord. Oh, that's a good card. Regenerate. Pirate ship. <laughs> Pirate ship. Summon ship, uh, <laughs> Dragon Well, Brothers of Fire, Flare. Oh, this is from like fourth edition. I feel like, is it? I don't know. Dragon Well, Div this is a beautiful card. Divine Transformation is probably one of the prettiest cards in the game. Huh, interesting. Tar Pain Spell Blast. <laughs> Ooh, like it's nice when you look at Unlimited and not Unlimited. Yeah, Unlimited. And you can tell it's so different from Revised. Oh, another pirate ship. I'm pretty sure this is a rare. And back in the day, pirate ships were really good. Ooh, the first time we have encountered poison counters. This card is pretty good. I like this card a lot. Uh, I used to play a combo where they orm chant in this card, and then it would just destroy all creatures. And back in the day, that was like pretty good. Unsummon uh, wall. Ooh, clockwork beast. <laughs> lots and lots of golems. Oh, the golems continue. Bottle of Solomon. Huh. Brass Man. This actually used to be one of the better cards in aggro. It used to be one of the strongest cards in the aggro ever. Alright, let's keep pulling. And Life Tap. More Life Taps. Uh, life Tap. Pretty good card. I used to think Life Gain was really good, and then I felt like it was really bad. Blue Elemental Blast. That's probably one of the more valuable cards in the set. Feedback, Phantom Monster, like Phantom Monster used to be fine. Four for a, oh, Crystal Rod, get into artifacts. Flying Carpet, Dancing Skip Scimitar, Urges, lots of glasses. Dragon Engine, I believe this is a rare. Aladdin's Ring, Aladdin's Lamp. Juggernaut, original Juggernaut, look at that. I mean, you just, wow, so many Juggernauts. You just don't get this. Uh, Disrupting Scepter used to be a very powerful card. Tomes, this used to be rare. Saddlebags, ooh, check this out. I just love the color, drain power. Tap all opponent's lands, taking all this mana and all the mana in opponent's mana pool into your mana pool. You can't tap fewer than all opponent's lands. Huh, is this card worth anything? It's not mana drain, but it seems like, 
Yeah, I mean, it's not bad. I'm pretty sure it's a rare. Um, Jade Monlith. I remember this one dude collected all the Jade Monliths, or I think Jade statues, and like, that was like his only. Ooh, Bell. This card was very good. I think this was a rare as well. Dingus Egg, I know, is a rare. Helm of. Look at this card. Jeez. Copper Tablet? What the heck? Copper Tablet. <laughs> More pirate ships. <laughs> Man. Alright, let's pull from here. Oh, this is like newer stuff, but I think they, they are uncommons. Yeah, these are uncommons. Fire Mental. Oh, great. Oh, yeah, nice. I love uh, the troll. A vinyl troll used to be very good. Uh, very, very good. And we're. Oh, this is Urza Saga. Elvis Lyric. I'll give you some Urza Saga to you. And then obviously you will still get a play mat in my packing video, which I had to pack. Is this? I'm pretty sure this is a rare. I am in Island Fist. I remember seeing that. More life taps, cause why not? Uh, Phantom. Oh, slight, slight of hand. Oh, more of these calls. Love. Reconstruct. Oh, more pirate ships. Is pirate ship a rare? I feel like it was, cause I traded it back way back. Spell blast. Hunters. Oh, <laughs> yes, of course, the foul eyed, which I name I just butchered. I know. Okay, so that'll be box one. Box two, let's see what we can get in box two. And then obviously, I'll put that in a hard case. Ooh, Cursed Land. Ooh, <laughs> you know, the very beginning of uh, that deck was back when. Ooh, Kindle used to be so good. This was probably good too. Like six six with trample, with seven. Um, yeah, yep, yeah, yep, yeah, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. More side slight of mind. Ooh, swamp, old school swamp. What is so special about this swamp? It looks very different. This swamp looks really different from any other swamp I've seen. It looks like a fake. It looks like it's fake, but like, why would you fake a swamp? This is a very interesting, it doesn't feel right. Okay, I'm gonna keep this swamp. <laughs> I don't know what it is, but I really do not know what it is. All right, Fire Slinger, Circle Protection. Ooh, Ranger Vec, that used to be very good. Spontaneous com Combustion, more Kindles. Maybe you can have a whole place that have Kindles. Giant trap door, skeleton ship, because that's what you need. More, more scale war <laughs> used to be the best card ever. More, oh, more scale worms, nice. Okay, Urza Saga stuff, and then the rest of the uncommons from that block. Like, what is this? It, like, you have to feel it. It doesn't feel right, and it doesn't look right either. It might be from like a anthologies deck or something. The printing's different. Yeah, it just doesn't feel like let's take an old card. Hmm, interesting. I've never seen it's not summer magic because it has that date. It doesn't have the date on it. Alright, let's see. What else do we have? More artifacts, more bags, more rings. Oh, cool, disperse. Now we're getting into um, Meriden, <laughs> which is interesting. I'm not gonna go through all this. Oh, this is a reprint, reprint time. And I don't think there's anything interesting in Meriden. Okay, more Meriden. I don't know why I have so much Meriden. Um, okay, let's put the Meriden in. And let's pick something that is, oh, I'll pick these. Cause I know these are good. Vampires, imps, evil presence, crumble. Crumble is really, this card is really good. Uh, Desert Twister, of course. Ooh, love this card. These, these cards are just, wow, I have like so many of them. A truly unique collection for Dan. Ooh, more life lace? Oh, this is the reverse of life lace. This is life force. Okay. 
And that's it. So I'll do my packaging video sometime after pre-release and then get everyone, you guys. I also have like other raffles I have to give. So yeah. Bye guys.